Good afternoon. I am Rahul, and you are watching PME Vidya channels and NCERT's official YouTube channel. Uh, we bring you the session of English class 10th, and uh, today we are going to learn. Uh, I must say, we are going to read and understanding the poem for Anne Gregory, uh, written by W. B. Yeats. And for this wonderful discussion, we have Professor Rama Meghanathan in the studio. Thank you very much, sir, for joining with us. Good afternoon. Good a very afternoon, a good very afternoon. warm welcome. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, learners. Uh, though we have lost time, uh, we will uh, read the poem Anne Gregory. Yes. Uh, the lesson ten. Okay. And try to understand the poem. Right. Okay. This is let the main gist of the session. Yeah. You must understand the gist of the poem. Okay. All right. Right. So now let let's look at the slide. That there are some questions for you as well as the learners. <laughs> right, sir. So, uh, what are the occasions you feel sad? Okay. Mm. Oh, when I uh, when I failed in the exams. Maybe. Okay, that's one. Uh, <laughs> but natural for children. Natural for children, <laughs> yes. And otherwise. And yes. Okay. And if if uh, I was not able to go for play, then you for football, you just, yeah. yes, especially okay. for me. Uh, yeah. And occasions, uh, uh, <laughs> occasions. That's a mistake. The occasions uh, you feel sad about uh, um, others. Uh, uh, others. Okay. Mm. So the thing is, uh, mm. the problem is uh, once. Uh, my friend cannot come to play, mm. then uh, definitely I'll uh, be mm. very sad for him or her. Mm. Or they got lesser marks than me mm. in test. Okay. In my class. Okay. All, all, <laughs> all right. So, so that should not. Right. Be these are these are the normal hacks and the problems and the day yeah. when we feel sad for us and for ourselves and okay. for our friends. Okay. At times you feel sad about uh, something. Uh, uh, fine. Okay. Sometimes. We feel sad about many many other things. For Indeed. example, uh, for example, uh, what makes you feel sad uh, about ourselves sometimes? No. Okay. So we have not done this. We could have achieved more and mm. something like that. Okay. Here the, the idea is this poem is about someone who feels sad. Okay. Because uh, uh, the girl doesn't like him because he doesn't hold something. Okay. So he is not very rich kind of thing. Okay. So is that true? That's what we are going to see through this poem. Okay. Uh, now look at it. Let, 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 let's read the slide there. Okay. Uh, uh, let me read the poem out to you, uh, learners. Then we'll have, never shall a young man thrown into despair by those great honey colored ramparts at a year, love you for yourself alone, not your yellow hair. Okay. Then the girl replies, but I can get you a hair dye and set such a color there, brown or black or carrot, that young men in despair may love me for myself alone and not for my yellow, yellow hair. Then the young man says again, I, I heard, I heard, that's a mistake there, I, okay. heard, I heard an old man, old religious man, but yesterday, yesterday night declare that he had found a text to prove that only God my, my, dear. my dear could love you for yourself alone, but not for yellow, yellow hair. hair. So, uh, what is your uh, first thoughts uh, for your uh, and, and the poem, uh, Raghuji? Ji, sir, uh, let's read the poem when we started. When we have started reading, mm. never shall a young man thrown into despair mm. by those great honey-colored ramparts at your ear. Mm. Okay, so ramparts uh, are the kind of thing that. Uh, hold the structure of the building kind of and a very no, strong no, no, strong uh, pillars uh, there's a palace and behind which there's a wall to protect it okay block it means you okay. can't see the palace okay so why, why does the point use uh, never sell a young man thrown into despair yes those great honey colored right uh, ramparts at your ear love you for yourself alone not for your yellow hair right why, why, why does look, look at the slide there okay uh, uh, the first time i come uh, appears uh, a young man, don't get into despair. Don't don't get into despair. Don't oh. be sad okay. because uh, by those honey eye, honey eye, honey colored ramparts at your ear, love mm -hmm. you for yourself alone, mm -hmm. not for your yellow hair. Mm -hmm. so, so you know this girl uh, is blocked by her possessions. Okay. Possessions. So she feel, he feels that she will not love him anymore. Okay. So that, that that then in that case, what he feels? Oh. I love you for yourself, not for your possessions. Right. Not for a yellow hair. Yellow right, hair sir. is supposed to be means uh, mean rich, white kind of thing. Right. Then then the the lady says, look at the second stanza. Uh, okay. But I can get the hair dyed. <laughs> yes. Uh, it seems if I, I mean I can change the color. I, I can change the color. Yes. Uh, and such uh, what is the color? Brown, black, carrot. Carrot. Yes. Uh, any color that young man in despair 
may love me for myself alone not for the hat right so look at it very simple right. but very effective right then the man again says i heard an old religious man last night yesterday night declared that he had found a text to prove mm-hmm. that only god my dear, my dear could love anyone for himself right you for yourself but not your elder yes so who so uh, generally how we how we judge people uh, rahul uh sometimes appearance sometimes appearance sometimes their possession yes sometimes their and, health and and their wardrobe everything, everything. Their, uh, but is the, that right the person or depicts yes but so this poem tells us that we should be with the person only uh, yeah. not for the outlook of yeah. the person uh, that, that's what no um, uh, gandhi ji once said look at the look at the persons uh, the way uh, the way they are but don't expect them to be what you want them to be. yes so we agreed. generally have values i apply to others right. that that's what the, the uh, look at the first times again okay uh, uh, never sell a young man thrown into despair mm-hmm. by those great honey colored ramparts of you see we we humans are blocking ourselves with uh, walls right what are the walls wealth color, color decoration right, makeup right so he says so come out of that right now people for themselves right be so natural I, I, yeah be natural uh, and be natural and look at uh, uh, love them for their behaviors right. for their actions right and and thinking right. not for their appearance right that's what look at the second stanza again okay. the lady replies uh, but i can i can change myself you know right i uh, that means i can become rich or poor within no time right. i can even um, support uh, people uh, by my actions uh, pretend to be good so but please love me for myself not my not for my yellow, yellow hair yes then then the man says oh i i met a man yesterday mm-hmm. and he 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 quoted from a religious text maybe gita quran or uh, bible anything and he said only god can do that i can't do that god god, god only could love you for yourself not for anything now this is learners this is the, the, these are the three stanzas of the poem but it conveys great meaning now look at the uh, slide that this is written by this was written by william butler yeats yes uh, he was an irish poet irish nationalist mm-hmm. he was a naturalist and a kind of progressive thinker uh, he looks at uh, how the society behaves with people right that that that's what and he says uh, be like god love people for their action not for their possessions okay and objects now right. Now look at it uh, uh, let me read this stanza again i think we have only 10 minutes more right sir never sell a young man thrown into despair mm-hmm. by those great honey colored ramparts that you hear mm-hmm. love you for yourself alone and not your yellow hair right so, whatever you are blocking whatever you are decorating whatever you are possessing objects i am not going to look at it right then the lady says look at it uh, uh let, let's look at the uh, first stanza uh, uh, d- have a discussion on that okay. who is addressing who here the young man is addressing the lady oh, yes uh, who is thrown into despair the young man uh, quite naturally yes. because the, the she sh- he thought that the, the rich lady would not love him right why sh- uh, why he is thrown into despair i have said already yes because see he sees yellow hair well looking right then what does it mean to say love you for yourself alone right what does it mean uh so that you should love the person to whom you meet only now uh, means not for the possessions of by her or uh, him a uh, very good great right. great because now, nowadays in the, in the time of social media people would like to post the pictures my latest possession mm. just to show off the people and that's the way and the william butler yeats i think this poem was written somewhere around decades ago uh, or, yeah, or maybe almost 50 60 years more than 60 that 60 years mm. ago and i think he was uh, able to Uh, see the future <laughs> yeah that's right <laughs> then now now look at the second stanza okay. uh, yeah look at the second stanza but i can get a hair dye mm-hmm. and set such a color there she says i can change my color if mm-hmm. you want to be if you want this different color i will change see yes. it shows that the pretension of humans right and showing off their possessions my love but young man you should love me for myself alone right. not for my possessions right yellow hair right. look at it uh, why do i say the lady says i can, can get, get the hair dye, dye changed because the humans can change yes. any time yes any time uh, yeah. dye is yeah. available uh, yeah why <laughs> <laughs> why are the young man in despair again because they are not getting the right kind of person right they are they are they are scared of people with possessions 
then look at the why do young men uh, love me for myself alone not for my yellow, yellow hair. hair yes so she says that no please look at me in a me my actions my character right then love me don't love me for my right. position who is sad the young men uh, or the man or young woman yes the young woman uh, no both of them are both sad. both of them i actually uh, yes, Uh, are said uh, because there's a problem with the uh, wealth and yes. money okay if you if you are hungry if you eat you are mm. satisfied mm. but you are hunger for money yes. well it will never you be you cannot satisfied. be satisfied yes agreed sir so that, that's what that <laughs> the point is trying to tell us yes. look at people and their character right. not their wealth and right. possessions objects look right. at it then the man replies i had an old religious man but yesterday night declared he declared mm. that he had found in the text holy text that only god can could love you for yourself alone not, not for, for your you. yellow hair yes so god looks at all of them as equal yes. that's what he is not extending anybody's life or shortening right. somebody's life right if he decides decides right. so look at it now let's uh, let's ref reflect on the poem uh, what is the uh, what we are people thrown into despair sad feel about themselves I uh, asked. The, we started with the first yes, question. Yes, yes. Why that, are people thrown into despair? Uh, because they think uh, those materialistic things, those they cannot afford, but they are greedy for the uh, products or maybe the uh, biological things. They uh, despair. It is something. You no, know? it, well, it's not that you are you are only sad. Mm. You are also thinking bad about. Yes. I don't yes, have yes. that. So they see me not like. It. Yes. Now look at the second. You part. cannot be happy if you want to be happy. Yes. If you are in disparity, yes. right, right, Why sir. Why does the poet say, "Great honey-colored ramparts at your"? Yes. He will not listen to other other people because right. he only sees he has yellow hair. Yes. And there are walls. A wall uh, kind of thing, so that they cannot hear. Yeah. Right. And this, there are many people. Even sometimes we feel we 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 later realize, oh, I should have listened to that person. Right, right, exactly. Uh, what does yellow hair mean here? Okay, uh, the age of the. Person? Age and appearance, wealth, right. possessions. Right. Then why does the young man there want the uh, want the young woman to love her for uh, herself? The okay. young woman said, "I may have yellow hair or whatever, I can change it, right. but love me for myself." Myself, not for my wealth. Oh, yes. Not for my and possessions. Look at that. Yes. Two more questions. We don't have much time. Yes. Yes. Uh, hardly we have four minutes. Uh, what does the religious text say about God's love? Okay. God loves. people for themselves right not for their possessions right does god love people for the color of the property color or the properties <laughs> no no god loves people as they are yes. whether you are yes. rich or poor god loves right And how do you value people based on their objects materials education status or their behavior or values right but nowadays we should uh, value people uh, from their behavior and their education only if i am right ah uh, no, no education sees it's not that uh, people don't want to get educated on their own. right it is their situation right and at the end of the day what is what does education mean it's and not getting degrees no? and and somebody is able to you know provide education to someone those who cannot afford that would be the great thing great. nowadays so love people yes. for themselves right so let's read the poem again okay close it okay never shall a young man thrown into despair by those great honey colored ramparts at your ear love you for yourself alone not for the yellow hair right then but i can she says but i can get hair dye and set such color there brown or, or black, black or, or carrot, carrot that young man in despair, despair may love me for myself alone not for my yellow hair i i heard an old man there's a mistake there i heard an old uh, let me go back to original one Uh, first one is not. I heard an old, please. Uh, I I heard an old religious man of yester yester night declare that he had found a text to prove that only God, my dear, could love you for yourself alone and not for your yellow hair. Right. And Perfectly you, fine. Perfectly so, fine. Uh, So this is the gist of the poem that we should love the person as they are. Oh, not not for the property of right. things. 
and particularly when you fall in love with people <laughs> right. uh, that's why uh, you are young children in class 10 to 1 uh, when you become an adult keep this in mind that's what <laughs> wb eats is uh, trying to tell us uh, uh, it's not the appearance right. uh, it is not the possession that right right okay let's also tell the learners some of the things please read the poem two three two or three times alone uh, silent or uh, read out to yourself but read it alone then look at the exercise uh, activities given at the t- end of the poem there are lots of discussions and also we have audio text of the poem okay. uh, well narrated better than my reading out <laughs> so you can enjoy it and write your reflections on the poem uh, how you feel uh, oh, generally everybody wants to be wants to look handsome and beautiful right. but the poet says the yellow hair doesn't matter to right. you but something more than that right i thought that's what i'll stop it there if i don't think uh, they may have contacted any question right. because it was uh, if we if we get any questions uh, definitely we will uh, transfer it to you so that you can answer them l- later on i also wanted to request uh, um, uh, the learners there if they want any specific lessons now it's class 10 uh, examination is coming in three may i don't know when the examinations will happen because we have to do it uh, right uh, online uh, uh, this one uh no we can't do it online because lots of okay. number of children right right uh, after vaccine only most right. likely so please send your queries uh, on particular topics on which we want you want us to take uh, okay. uh, sessions we right. will do that right uh, thank you very much thank you rahul sir thank you very much for joining with us I, as you have explained this uh, poem uh, wonderfully in just a precise time so thank you very much for joining with us in the in the studio thank you thank you so that's all for this uh, session of english we will be right back with the session of mathematics don't go away keep watching namaskar <laughs>